Today is a first alert weather day. Temperatures soaring in some parts of our region. Let's take a look at Drone 13. It was flying high above Lake Natoma earlier today. Some beautiful shots there. And things were they heating up out there, triggering some warnings for certain parts of Northern California. Chief Meteorologist Nick Marianos is here with the first alert forecast. Nick. Yeah, temperatures are going to be up into the one teens uh, for north of Sacramento tomorrow. It's a nice day, maybe for a backyard pool if you're further down to the south or taking the kayak out, go paddle boarding Folsom Lake uh, tomorrow because temperatures won't be as hot compared to just north of town. So uh, here's the forecast. Get you the door for tomorrow morning. A lot of sunshine starting to lower 60s, but then we warm up pretty quick into the middle and upper 90s. I think in Sacramento, we'll see temperatures approaching 100. But just north of town, it's a different story. We'll be looking at temperatures ranging from 105 to 110 across parts of uh, Sutter and Yuba, Yuba County. And parts of Plumas County could see temperatures approaching the lower 1 teens, about 110, 112. And further north, you have plans going to Redding. Tomorrow, we could be looking at highs approaching 110 to 115. We had a high of 114 in Reading earlier today. We're sitting at 106 in Williams, 96 downtown, 101 still in Oroville. And then as you go down to the south across parts of the San Joaquin Valley, temperature is not as warm. Look at the Delta breeze, too, we have quite the variation. It's a bit breezy if you're going down toward Fairfield right now, and temperatures in Fairfield into the upper 80s because of that breeze coming off of the, uh, off the Delta coming in from the Pacific. That marine layer is keeping things quite cool. But here's what's the setup for tomorrow. High pressure and control. The heat is with us through Friday. But going into Saturday, into Sunday, just in time for the weekend, the uh, pattern starts to change. High pressure starts to shift down toward the four corners. That pulls up some of that monsoonal moisture from the desert southwest. And that could trigger some isolated Sierra storms. Keep that in mind Sunday if you have hiking plans into the mountains uh, by, by the afternoon, though. Sunday afternoon, we're also watching that area of low pressure just off the coast. And this is going to help change the pattern into next week. Believe it or not, we may see temperatures at or just below normal uh, for highs. 62 into the morning, uh, and then we climb back up into the middle and upper 90s across parts of the valley. Stockton going for a run at about 100 degrees. Uh, Modesto at 99 for tomorrow afternoon. The Delta breeze keeping temperatures in Sacramento closer to about 100 degrees for highs with lots of sunshine. But we will see some of that air quality reducing uh, some of that smog and ozone lower levels of the atmosphere as well. So watch out for that tomorrow under this heat. And then further to the north into the valleys with those temperatures are peaking about 110, 112 to 115. So uh, at least it's not sticking around all the way through the weekend. Look at Saturday, Sunday. Uh, great weekend forecast. Down to 93 on Sunday. Then you can kind of see the effects of the new pattern setting up to next week. Not as hot. Temperatures lower to mid-90s. Tony, I think you'll like that one. Guys, back over. Like it a lot, Nick. Yeah. Thanks.